Hello everybody, this is Srinu Machagoni. Here is our video called Database Replication along with a couple of problems and solutions um, <clears throat> that, that, uh, that is based on database replication strategy. Right, let me, start, let me tell you the actual definition of database replication. Uh, <clears throat> it's database replication is a distribution of information across a series of servers which may be located in the same place or which may be located across the globe. Let us start the actual demo part that introduces two real-time problems while implementing database replication followed by the solution provided by the database expert. Hey Sushank, what's up man? Hey man, what's up? How are you doing man? Bad man, I'm not doing well. Why? What happened? You know, I hate this job man, I hate this job. See, our boss gave me a task to work on the database. He says the performance of the database is very slow. I was trying to work on it the whole day. But it's not, it's not an easy task, you know. Our database is very big with 1 terabytes of data, 800 tables and 4000 triggers. Adding to that, we have around 20,000 users all over the world. So obviously the performance will be very slow because we have only one single server. I was trying to do work on it the whole day, but I couldn't do anything. Even this is not my idea. I have a problem with the database server. Really? Really, yeah. As, a, as you know, uh, last week we, we got a flood in Mississippi and yeah. Illinois, uh, so I have a, I have, I'm facing the problem. I'm unable to connect with the server in that location. Uh, since last night I was working on working out on this issue, but I didn't find any solution. Yeah, man, we need to think of a solution for this. I think it's better to contact an expert to get any kind of solution. Yeah, of course, man, we need, we need an expert for this, you know. Okay, let's, let's meet expert. What is the status of our new product? Okay. So it will be on time, right? Okay. So that will be fine. Yeah. You are going good. Excuse me, sir. May I come in? Yes, get in. Hello, sir. Hi Sushan, how are you doing? What is your current status? Uh, yes, I'm good. Um, I'm actually here to talk about the task you gave me. Okay. I was trying to work on, work on it the, the whole day, but okay. there's nothing I can do to improve the performance. I mean, it's not in my hand. I try my best. So. What about you, Sunny? Uh, actually, we have a problem with the, one of the database server. We are unable to connect with the, one of the database server in the Mississippi. Uh, here's the report. Uh, for the actual status of the project. Okay. So, do you think do we have any revenue issues? Uh, uh, I think so. We need. That's why. We or do we have any legal report? Question? Yes, I think so. So, what do you think? Do we need to call an expert or something like that? Yeah, that would be better. I think it's better to contact the any okay. expert. Give me a second. the database replication which is a, which comes to the rescue of two problems one being the performance issue and other being the disaster recovery now this is a normal operation of a database uh, suppose this is a hypothetical situation where the reservation agent connect to an application server which is directly connected to the database server what if the connectivity between the database server is down or the uh, database server located at different part of the world might be uh, might be crashed due, due to an earthquake or due to some floods then, then the entire system will be down. In order to solve these problems, in order to solve these problems, the only way is to replicate the entire database server to a backup server, which is directly connected via internet. 
in this in this type of situations uh, the all the transactions which are sent to the database server will be also sent to the backup server which is being maintained by the backup update so in case if this database server is down we can still use a backup server this kind of setup is normally used for the performance wise have some reservation i have some analytics going this analytical data analytical might take more than more than a day or two weeks to analyze all the entire amount of data if you have a large amount of a database it might take more than a week to analyze the entire database to come up some with some analytical analytical things so what what happens if everybody is trying to access the main database server the load on the main database server will be too high in order to in order to uh, to to have a better performance we can do two things one in the same way as you replicate this into a backup server you can replicate another copy to another another database server called as database analysis server and we can divide the users into two things right we can divide the, uh, we can divide the uh, users into two things one being some one being uh, a reservation agents who are who are trying to access the database server and other being the database analysts who are trying to access this server in this case as the load between the database is reduced by half the performance will goes up by uh, performance increases by double hi guys i'm back i hope you learned a lot about database replication after watching this video thanks for watching all right now let us start the actual demo part oh no what am i doing hello guys what is your status <laughs> Hi. You can see the data replication point. The bini. Up. अरे ना वाला आरे बस नीचे इस तरह उनको रहा. Hi guys, I'm back. I hope you guys. कंजर्वा.